news is that the Dollar Tree has a brand new line of cross stitch kits. The bad news is that I don't think the person who designed these knows what cross stitch is or how it works. I'm Michelle. This is my romantic tangle. I was pleasantly surprised by the Dollar Tree's last set of cross stitch kits and the quality. So I was really happy to see online that they had new ones and then I tracked them down in the store and oh my gosh, I am confused. And I know how to cross stitch. Cross stitch is my thing. So how are these going to work for people who don't know how to cross stitch? I will say they come with a needle, they come with a plastic hoop, they come with a threader, but if you look at the picture, that is a pic line drawing that is printed over Ada. When you look at the Ada, they have printed the pattern on the fabric. This does not line up necessarily with the squares on the fabric. I don't know if this is supposed to wash out or not. This one's black. <clears throat> and if you look at the line drawing, it looks like those little stars and the little black lines are just supposed to be left there. I, I don't get it, guys. The only instructions they give you are on the back of your card. They tell you to basically to use two strands and make an X. I don't know if this printing is supposed to wash out. I'm going to suspect that it doesn't based on the fact that these stars and lines look like they're supposed to be permanent. I don't know with the shapes on these flowers, which don't show up well on the camera, how well you're going to be able to fill this in. Do they want you to use partial stitches? Is someone who goes and buys a cross stitch kit at the Dollar Tree crafter square going to have the <sighs> what do you think this is kind of a train wreck i am trying to only stitch the squares that are mostly within the lines but that leaves me with sections like this where this square isn't within the lines but it will sure look a lot nicer if i fill those in and the way that these lines are blurring as I handle it to stitch, I think they are intended to wash out. Not that anyone stitching this from Dollar Tree's instructions would have any way of knowing that. Or someone who had not done stamped cross stitch would have any reason to guess you were supposed to wash these lines out. It's a process. It would be great if it was embroidery. But to do it as cross stitch on Ada is just a really weird choice. I wanted to love these. The designs are cute. They are generous with the supplies. This is totally the wrong size and wrong type of needle though. It leaves huge holes in the fabric and it is a pointed needle, which is not what you generally would use for counter cross stitch. I did use that needle to stitch the eye and I did fight it the entire time. It's a cute design. There is a lot of black left over around the stitches. I am thinking that this might wash out, but again, why would it? Because of the little stars. The flower is printed in light yellow, and I got this far before deciding I am not going to stitch this anytime soon. It was hurting my eyes and stressing me out and it wasn't fun. I would not recommend these to a beginning cross stitcher. They are very frustrating. If anyone else has stitched them, I would love to see it. I love that the Dollar Tree keeps coming out with new craft kits. I wish these had been a little better thought out. Last year, I stitched one of their embroidery kits. It was an adorable little bee. I had a blast doing it and no complaints. These aren't as much of a hit, unfortunately. Thank you for watching. I'm Michelle. This is my Romantic Tangle, and I'll be back with you with more videos soon, and I will let you know if those lines wash out or not.